Alright, welcome again, ladies and gentlemen. This is part two of my trip to Columbus. Four of the Arnold Classic, so this is day two and three. Pretty much combined both days. I'm only showing you the workouts from day two and not day three, and I got up early in the morning because my early AM workout that Sunday morning was basically a hodgepodge of everything else I did because I was trying to hit any of any and every just doing random stuff that morning. But Saturday morning, I said, let's go ahead and make this like a full out leg day, which I did. So you can see here, I started off with the V squat machine, then high squat, then leg press, then some lunges, then some extensions, then some leg curls, some Romanian deadlifts, and some calves. So yeah, Sunday, it was me doing like a quick and dirty shoulders and arm day. So basically, it was a repeat of what I did Thursday. And more or less, I did not want to bore you guys up making this feel too, too long. So, and not too many words. It was basically the same movements I did in the Thursday video. I'm oh, sorry, Friday morning video. Well, anyway, if that makes any sense, the Friday morning video that I posted Monday. Well, anyway, after doing that, we're riding to high school as mentioned earlier, then leg press, lunges, and pretty much killed my legs right before going to the expo. Went to the expo, started walking everything out, cramped up a little bit, but nothing too crazy. So, anyway, maybe close my mouth a little bit and let you guys watch the rest of this footage.
Okay, at this point, my legs are basically fried, cooked, and completely done over with. Then, like I said, skip calves. I mean, I train calves, but then record it because I'm like, you know, I know, similar calf routine. See the calf raises, then the calf raises, something new. And also, speaking my legs, much props to these men that you'll see in a few seconds I did the wheelchair physique. These guys killed it in the bodybuilder show. These guys are disabled, and yet they still kill it, and you'll see it in a few minutes. So, yeah. I respect to them and basically basic proof of this. If you got limitations, you can still get in. No excuses, do your best. But anyway, let me shut up. Let the gentlemen do their thing. Competition, guys. Thank you. Back in line. As you see, I got quite a bit of work left to do. But anyway, with the convention center, I had to meet with some people. A few bodybuilders. You saw Juji Mufu. And yeah, I got way more work to probably get to his level. Or oh, is my man's level right here. As well as some other people that I saw up there. So, went around the convention center. Called some people. Met some people. Shook a few hands. And even met a few more people when I left the convention center and went back to the hotel. And walked to the gym. Because walking to the gym. Look who I bumped into, none other than Mr. Larry Wills, right before getting a push-pull focus arm session in, which you'll see right here, or just a push-pull chest and back session. So, start off with pretty much every back exercise and every chest machine I can get to, so I kind of alternate between chest and back throughout the entire session to get as much of a pump as I can get in, because you'll see right at the end of this, I want to get in. Well, I'm trying to pump up as much as I could because right afterwards I want to actually work on my poses. So I figure like, let me get the best pump possible while I'm pro gym and then pose afterwards. You know, let me shut up and show you, let you just look at all the footage I did. And yes, I went freaking crazy. And yes, you're going to see everything I did, which explains why I had that freaking insane pump at the end. Anyway, let me shut up.
All right, at this point, my chest and back were really fried, so I just had, so right now, I'm like, you know what, let me go get my biceps in. Trash was somewhat decent, but biceps definitely need to be bigger, so I started to go ahead and seated chest, sorry, seated bicep curl machine, preach curl machine, and then of course, went to another machine, get a little more back in before I started my pose routine. And posing, it is what it is, definitely to cut some more fat, and work my pose back to the side, which you'll see within a few minutes. I run because I feel like I actually look better in the mirror at home after I train legs the following day and mind and muscle gym. But you know it is what it is. Probably because of the lighting, who knows? But yeah, still working on everything. Definitely need to do more work on the front, more than anything else. A little bit on the bleeds. Back starting to come in a lot better. And actually, my back looks way better than other sides. So yeah. I'd rather look worse on camera than in person. But anyway, after doing this, I went back to the hotel, went to sleep, and got ready for the next day at the event center. Met up a few more people and then tried my hand at some strong man stuff afterwards. Oh! Uh -huh. 